and that leads me to introducing our provost, Dr. Howard Silk. It is my pleasure to introduce Dr. Silk. Dr. Silk is a robotics engineer, he's a husband and a father, he has numerous patents, he's a researcher, and he's celebrating his one year anniversary here at Lawrence Technological University. Please join me in welcoming Dr. Howard Silk, provost at Lawrence Technological University. Thank you, dear Ben. Good morning, all. Greetings and a warm welcome to our new students. I would like to congratulate our students on the wisdom of their decision to join the LTU community of involved, active, and accomplished learners. Welcome to Lawrence Tech. Welcome. And let me also welcome the many distinguished guests parents, colleagues, alumni, and supporters of our university, and those who are the friends and admirers of our students, and our special honoree, the 2122 Global Citizen Award recipient. Thank you all for being with us. This new student convocation marks the official opening of Lawrence Technological University's 2021-2022 academic year. A year of fresh new beginnings and new ways of looking at our ever-changing world. This fall semester also marks the 89th anniversary of the founding of LTE. On September 6, 1932, Laras Institute of Technology opened with the first class of several hundred students. LTU founder Russell Lawrence, supported by close members of his family and a band of loyal and dedicated fa faculty, decided to embark on an amazing new adventure. Russell Lawrence's rare formula, rare formula included evening classes for working students and a hands-on real-world experiential education that included both theory and practice. This soon captured the imaginations of hundreds, if not thousands more. Key among these were Henry Ford and his son, Edson, who offered our school a suitable building at the edge of their manufacturing complex in Ivan Park, famous as the birthplace of the modern assembly line and the former home of the Model T. This provided an amazing incubator for showcasing the work of work and creative problem solving. In the 89 years since, Nearly 40,000 women and men have graduated from Lotus Tech. Tens of thousands more have come for credentials, certifications, and taken classes. We are proud that so many has achieved so much in their professions and communities. And we're so proud that you will join us very soon as alumni of Lotus over the past 89 years, alumni-led companies and organizations have provided livelihood, economic development for millions of people, locally, regionally, nationally, and internationally. The high-quality technological education we are about to participate in, enriched with the liberal arts, is demanding and challenging, and it is exactly what is needed to prepare you for the jobs and the careers of the future. I want to assure you, our students, that we, faculty, staff, and administration, and trustees of LPU, believe in you and in the efforts that you will be putting forth to achieve your goals. The Brookings Institution and other independent measures tell us all that your new university is amongst the most successful in America in providing you with the attributes that will prepare you for challenging, rewarding, and high-paying occupations. You are joining one out of 13 doctoral private technological universities in the whole nation, which is home to 6,000 institutions of higher education. Yes, give it, give it a hand. <laughs> LTU is truly with an elite company, and we're glad that you joined us. We are here to encourage you, to challenge you, to guide you, and to help you acquire the knowledge, skills, and abilities that you seek and need in an ever more competitive world. 
Today, you're joining a university with that great and proud history. Lawrence Tech is an innovative professional university. We are the creative university of the future that ensures eminent high-paying professional careers for you, our future alumni. We are a university that produces technologically savvy graduates, no matter degree, no matter what degree they attain or discipline they choose to study. The reality is that we are a university that prepares students for 21st century interdisciplinary careers and jobs that don't even exist yet. LTU is a private university operating for the public good and is focused on offering an engaged educational experience involving problem-based learning. Our approach and great student outcomes are possible due to the amazing efforts of our committed and dedicated world-renowned faculty members. I ask that the faculty members who are among us and the audience to please rise. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, this faculty provides the real-world exciting research and development opportunities the students can engage in, activities that take theory into practice, which is LTU's model. The student mentorship and faculty guidance are amongst our great differentiators as an institution of higher learning. Thank you to our faculty. We are, as the LTU faculty and staff, are charged with the responsibility of educating you, preparing you for future success. But we are confident that we will also learn a great deal from you on this journey. From your compassion, your enthusiasm, your hard work, and dedication. And we are so very proud of each and every single one of you. Welcome to LTU. The 20th century philosopher John Dewey explained the relationship between and life best. Quote, education is not preparation for life. Education is life itself. May you never stop learning and spreading your knowledge to others. It is our duty to share our earned wisdom with our families, friends, and communities. And with the shared knowledge comes added value and opportunity. Also, Benjamin Franklin once said, that an investment in knowledge pays the best interest. And in an ever-advancing technological world, perhaps a technological education in all the Lawrence Tech disciplines and majors is the most valuable asset. You are the future of our world, and we are counting on you. I'm looking you at, you, at you here today and seeing the beautiful harmony of different genders different cultures and different disciplines. Yet, your hard work, your dedication, motivation, and willingness to become better individuals bring all of you here to this convocation today. Now, as different as we are, we are also the same, and we all now belong to the same prestigious family, the Lawrence Tech family. Welcome to our family. You just joined our family as our students. Sooner than you think, you will graduate, and you will remain to be in our family as our colleagues and friends. You completed assignments, projects, took exams, your paper, did presentations at your high schools and beyond, and your hard work resulted in your admission and joining LTU. We will aim at owning your skills as architects, engineers, designers, scientists, business leaders, Computing professionals, decision makers, managers of the future, and much, much more. You will build friendships that will last you a lifetime. Meet with people from all over the world. Learn from their cultures, their countries, their beliefs. And at the end, I'm sure you will come to the same conclusion that I did. There is no country, no belief, that denies the value of education. It is treasured everywhere, respected globally, and 
embraced by all nations. By all nations. The international student community and U.S. students and their families participate with faculty and staff in a multitude of great activities in and out of Lawrence Tech classes. These experiences evolve to new friendships and exploration of diversity in cultural, religion, languages, and others, institutional global connections, and future opportunities. The globalization and internationalization of Lawrence Tech's campus, and in particular, the development of the Global Village Project, is the brainchild of Dr. Brinder Mutlu, our president and chief executive officer of Lawrence Tech University. Due to his dedicated efforts in global engagement, international involvement, exemplary vision in globalizing global tech, and providing truly eminent international opportunities to both our domestic and international students, LTU is what it is today, a distinctive global university. Not only providing local, regional, or national professional and cultural opportunities to students, but also provides international experiences of great significance. Internationalization and globalization is simply part of our DNA as an institution of idea. Through the years, LTU and Dr. Mundell have presented the Global Citizen Award annually at this competition to recognize exceptional individuals who have shown character and leadership in addressing global issues and promoting global understanding amongst people, communities, and organizations worldwide. And now I'd like to take a moment and I would like to invite Trustee Beth Baker and Dr. Brenda Whitwell, the second president and CEO of the Western Global. It is my pleasure and great honor to announce on behalf of Florence Technological University and all its constituents that the recipient of this year's 2021-2022 Global Citizen Award is a leader who epitomizes what a global citizen is and should be. My friend, our President and CEO, Dr. Grinder Butler. Congratulations. Thank you all so much, and Dr. Woodville is now going to ask you.